it has been a while. It has been a while since I reviewed on Primo TV, and I decided, eh, why not? Dare to say, why not? I might as well see what they have in store currently, and oh gosh, just kind of expected. I mean, they got some updates. I mean, they got the last kids on Earth. Pac-Man The Ghost Adventures is still here, and then you get the saying everything. Bakugan, Bat, Pat, Grossology, and they had this thing called Shrakers. Kong, King of the Ace, wasn't that on Netflix? Pac-Man The Ghost Adventures, they claimed it's only on Primo, well, actually, it isn't. Seriously, you can still watch it on the Cartoon Channel. Uh, I think YouTube has full episodes for free. It's not only on Primo. Uh, you got Skylanders Academy, the Tom Sawyer series. They confuse it with the 1980 AM, even though it isn't. Uh, some more stuff. When it was your age, Beyblade Metal Fusion. Don't you have Code Lyoko? Like, they're forgetting some stuff here and there. Like, it's not fully complete. Ah, oh, this is kind of disappointing. Well, what else do they have? Let me check their shows list. It's the exact same. Primo TV, you need to update your website. This isn't a good thing to see. You need to add more pages. You just have so many and now you've downgraded it? This is such a disappointment. Like, I have never been so disappointed about you, Primo TV. But, oh, I'm not that surprised given the fact that you're only available on Comcast. And the worst part... You're not even available there internationally. That's unfair. Seriously, I'm from Southern California. And it's not available there. It's on the Bay Area. It's on the Bay Area. But it is not on SoCal. It is only available on Tucson, West Palm Beach, Salt Lake City, Spokane, Miami, Philadelphia, Houston, Denver, Chicago, the Bay Area, Atlanta, and Albuquerque. That's not Fair. Like, seriously, Primo TV, it really needs to be in other T providers. International, well, not international, at least nationwide. Like, at least be on Comcast nationwide. Just don't be on just selected areas. That's not fair at all at this point. And what makes things worse is that Xfinity is kind of costly. And that's also a problem. Man, I did videos about Primo TV, and this really explains it all. It really needs to be in other TV providers. Be Me Kids, your sister channel, is on TV networks nationwide. It's on TV providers nationwide, like AT&T Uverse, for example, but not Primo TV. Oh, jeez Louise, it really needs to be fixed. Uh, might as well check out their games. Oh, they have this thing called Realm Hunter. It's just a Subway Surfers clone. That's it? That's it? And it was released in 2018? December 25th, Christmas. But still, you didn't even bother to have, like, online games of, your pa of at least Pac-Man Ghostly Adventures and Bakugan? Not even those? Wow. My disappointment is immeasurable, and my day sure is kind of ruined in a way. Well, it's not really ruined, it's just that Primo TV, you really need to get some updates here. It's just not good to see about the channel itself. Like, seriously, please, me and RT providers, please. And you need to add more show pages and at least a schedule. A schedule page would be nice. That would be nice for other channels do this. Kid Street does it. But not you. My goodness, Primo TV. You can be a disappointment sometimes. Also, when I was searching on Primo TV, it says TV shows, videos, games, photos, and memes. Well, that's kind of a lie because they don't show photos other than the show pages or the promotion in a way. And they sure don't show memes, so this is kind of clickbait for what Primo TV is doing. Also, if you want to put a watch button on Primo TV itself on the website... 
it really should have at least have a live TV screen so that people would at least watch it instead of just watching it on Xfinity slash Comcast as the only provider being available there. Overall, uh, Primo TV, you really need to fix this. You need to get a lot of updates. You need to ha- add some stuff in it. Add a schedule page. And if you want to put watch, you should have put live TV on it. Would be nice for a fast channel version of Primo TV. But that's wishful thinking. And the background, what are you, a fast food restaurant? Uh, well, all jokes aside, I mean, it does look kind of good, but doesn't really look like Primo TV that much, except for the, well, the promotion and the shows, and the game is just a Subway Surfer's clone. But, uh, yeah, honestly, I honestly hope Primo TV just gets access on RT providers, because it is like a curse. They don't even, they didn't even bar to have a Droner's page on it, despite still airing on the network. Anyway, guys, this is Kawhi Life Antonio, signing off. Peace.